the internet. Another quickie here for you. Um, and a few people asking about Professor Hugs, my mantis shrimp. So here she is, currently munching on a hand-fed feeder shrimp that was dead. Um, she has just molted. This is two days after the molt. She's not looking great, to be honest. Um, I think she might have shell rot. So I'm turning the lights down. I've done a water change today. And I'm just going to hope for the best, really. I am dosing iodine, as uh, you're meant to do with mantis shrimp. Apparently the lighting can be a source of shell rot. But the poor little gal hasn't been right for a couple of weeks now. So I am a little bit worried about her, because she's my baby. And she is still fascinating to watch, but she's spending a lot of her, her time with her face down. And I'm guessing that's the lighting. But you can see she's only a dinky little gal. And if it wants to focus... There we go. See the rest of the tank with all the hundreds of feeder shrimp in there. And I have added two peppermint shrimp to try and deal with the aptasia, which I've had absolutely no luck with uh, dealing with manually. I'm doing it about every other day with some lemon juice and then making sure that the magnesium, calcium, etc. is still right, because, of course, you're putting acids in your tank, so that's going to affect your pH. I'm just going to see if I can move around. You can see what I mean, because unfortunately... Dirty tank. Dirty glass. But yeah, you can see which is actually on her and which is just the glass. But she's got little spots, which isn't great. And as you can see, her, her shell's still very translucent. Ooh, that's a good, funny angle there. But she has always had problems with her raptorals, so... There we are. When I was hand feeding her, she knew that it was time for food, and she was just holding her raptorals out, just saying, gimme. So, no aggression towards me whatsoever. Never has been. And I think, you know, that is a concern as well. I'm not sure how great she was when I got her. And I was hoping after a couple of malts, things would sort themselves out. But they're not. So we're just going to have to see what happens with her, really. Anyway, hope you're all doing well. Um, hope you've got all your Christmas shopping done. If I don't speak to you beforehand, hope you all have a fantastic Christmas. Hope Santa brings you loads of prezzies. And hopefully speak to you soon. Glitch out.